Hey guys! So it was Australia Day when I started this project. And it's now the end of September and I'm finally finishing it. <laughs> anyway, there was a um, big sort of concrete block retaining wall just here. This is near the front door, near my shed. Um, and I ripped out all of the concrete blocks. They were heavy. And now I've got a big pile of dirt. So I hired a mini loader again. Um, this is the same mini loader as I used to move the big pile of dirt um, from behind the shed when um, I dug out or tried to dig out the veggie patch. So I know how to use the machine. I've got it for four hours and then I've got to get it back because they closed. Um, but I figure it shouldn't be too bad. Let's just get in and have a quick look at the dirt pile um, and then we'll get going. So the dirt pile, it's quite solid because I mean, this has been here for a while and I dug all of the bricks out from all the way around. They're all up there behind the shed, those horrible things. Um, this is also where I had the fruit trees for a while. So I do have some landscape fabric that I need to move and a couple of other bits and bobs, but that's okay. Um, my plan for the dirt is to, I mean, this land slopes up. I don't know if you can see it. I'll try and pan slopes up to the driveway. Um, so I would like to just kind of even this slope out, um, get this dirt and then just over here, I have a shallow patch in the land. So if I can move the dirt from here into this shallow patch and kind of just level it out a little bit, uh, level the slope up, um, it'll be messy and dirty and, and just gross for a while. But I'll throw some grass seed on, stick the sprinkler on it. Should be right. Should be right. Um, one day, like the proper landscapers will come in and make this all beautiful. But for now, I just want to get rid of that because I can't mow it. I can't be bothered whipper snippering it. It's got the ditch. It's got the thing. It's just ugly. And it would be nice to fill in this dip. So that's the plan. I'll let you know how I go. <laughs> All right, I've been going for about an hour and a half and I'm really happy with what I've achieved. Look at that. It looks so much better already, even though it is just a pile of mess. Um, so I've filled in a big amount of this divot. I am about to run over it a dozen times with the mini loader just to kind of flatten it out. I can see that it still dips a bit, so I can probably get a bit more soil in here. What I did up here though was I actually came in, dug up, dumped, dug, dumped, dug, dumped, um, rather than lift and shift because as I was pulling it out, you can see big clumps of dirt. Um, there was a lot of big clumps of dirt, a lot of big clumps of rock. So lifting it and dumping it loosened everything up. And now I'm just in the process of kind of moving it and this is allowing me to get the slope because the, the ground really does slope quite heavily. So I wanna get that, you know, reasonably neat. It's gonna make mowing so much easier. Uh, I am dumping a bit of dirt up there, you know, just need different places to dump dirt, really. So I'm gonna run over this, see how much more fill I can put in here. And then I'm just going to keep going. For an hour and a half, I'm feeling really good about this. I'm getting the hang of it. Stalled the pull machine a couple of times, but you know, that's to be expected. <laughs> All right, I am going to keep on going. So here we are, three and a quarter hours later. <laughs> I'm really happy with how the mini digger performed. Um, took a bit to get used to it, but you know, that's to be expected. So I've really filled in this, this dip here, which I'm happy about. It was one of my key goals. And of course I've leveled that area here out. Now it still slopes up, of course, but by leveling out, I mean, there's a lot less doo -doo -doo, like ups and downs. And of course the big pile of dirt isn't there. 
So I tried really hard to get it as flat and even as possible. There are still dips and divots. I mean, I'm not a professional, but I'm hoping that as this kind of flattens out, as I wet it down, get the sprinkler on it, uh, get grass seed on, it will kind of even out a bit more. I mean, one day, eventually, there will be professionals coming and installing nice, beautiful flat lawn, but that's a long way away. <laughs> so I am going to get this dude back to the shop and then come out here. There's a bit of raking I need to do and put the sprinkler on. Just wait for it to go. I'm really happy that I didn't trash any more of the yard. That makes me pleased. I was able to leave all of the destruction uh, to this little area, which I don't really go into that much anyway. Um, so it's a great outcome. Anyway, that is my project for the day. Really happy with the outcome, really happy with the mini digger. Um, and it's just super pleased that I've got that done. Mowing is gonna be so much easier now. <laughs> Bye guys.